Welcome to the weekly writing update for September the 12th, 2022. This past week, I wanted to get three chapters of Conjoining of Paragons done, and I managed it, despite a number of things working against me. I lost chunks of chapters several times due to power outages and some other things. The chapters themselves were just three of the most difficult I'd written. Also three of my favorites, and the most fun I've had writing the story. But there were times I wondered, how much am I going to get done, given how complex a balancing act many of these scenes were? But I managed to get the three full chapters done, and I'm actually really happy with it. I think from a progress standpoint, it's the most pleased I've been with a week in quite a while, probably since wrapping up P.O.P. Book 3, so that's nice. I'm hoping to get three more chapters of C.O.P. done this next week. I know that originally I said I was going to write Ashes of Chaos, and if you're a fan of AOC and you're looking for more of those chapters, don't be super alarmed by the fact it slipped back two weeks. It has nothing to do with Ashes, and everything to do with the fact that I'm really just on a roll right now with Conjoining of Paragons. It's the most fun I've ever had with the story, and I think I'm putting out the best chapters that I've ever put out for that story, so I want to keep going on that. One, because I'm enjoying it, and two, because I think it will be the best thing for the quality. Either way, I have two more weeks of concentrated fanfiction writing this month, and one's going to be on COP and one's going to be on AOC. That's going to be the case either way. So, the way I look at it, I could either write AOC this week, then come back and write COP, and the quality is probably not going to be as good because I've disrupted the flow, or I can just keep going now and put out better chapters, and to be completely honest with you, I don't think Ashes of Chaos is going to be affected either way in terms of quality. I'm going to be fighting an uphill battle with that one either way for a number of reasons that we'll get into during the next weekly writing update. <laughs> but yeah, that's my plan. Hopefully I can get another three COP chapters done. That will leave me with two chapters backlogged already. As I mentioned last week, I am hoping to backlog enough chapters so that in November I can just exclusively write my novel but have chapters posting on Patreon as normal. We'll see if that happens. I, I'm doing it much more intelligently this time than earlier in the year, and it's working pretty well so far, so we'll see if I can keep that up. One thing that has not gone as smoothly for me this past week are revisions on Perversion of Purity. It was really just one chapter that slowed me down, <laughs> to be completely honest. I ran into my first really hard revision chapter, and it took me three days, I think, to do. And the other problem is, this is the point of the year where the chapters are the longest. Instead of revising chapters that were, you know, originally 4,000 words, and I ended up cutting them down to 2,800, 2,700, I'm now editing chapters that are 6,000, 6,500 words, and I'm cutting them down to about 4,000. Yeah, um... It's just a lot of editing and rewriting when the chapters are that long, so I'm not quite managing to keep up a chapter a day. That pace is a little bit delusional when I'm dealing with these kind of chapters. Fortunately, that this point of the year where I'm editing right now is really the only time the chapters were consistently at that length, so I'm hoping that it's just going to get easier after the next three chapters, I think? Two or three chapters? Hopefully I'll get those done this week, plus maybe one or two more. Either way, I'm at about 33% in terms of the revisions for P.O.P. Book 3, but I think this is going to be my hardest stretch of the year. So once I'm done this, I'm hoping it's just going to move a little bit faster. Don't have too much else to say. It was a pretty straightforward week. It went pretty smoothly. Here's hoping for another one of these. I hope you guys enjoyed the update. Hope it was informative, and I hope you're looking forward to everything coming down the pipeline. Thank you guys all so much for listening, and I will talk to you next Monday.